to Ned, but Orlando is quick on the ball. On that recovery, Yates putting it ahead. The speed of Manda. Got there at the end line, played it across. There's the goal! Orlando! Angelina! Every bit of possession and territory that they have in the final third. Banda just chases this one down around Boutel. It's the initial run of Yates that leaves space for Angelina to surge out of that midfield position. A late arriving run into the penalty area. Banda does well to keep this one in. But what a finish from Angelina. The composure on the run. Sands. Almost lost it, now does to Bethune. Saar breaking in on goal. Ule Saar with a chip. Saar, 2-1, off the corner. Barba Banda getting on the score sheet was inevitable for this Orlando Pride team. Just at the right place at the right time and steers this header with pace and above Aubrey Kingsbury. Can't get a touch on it. She tries to manipulate her body, but there's too much pace from a close range. Unmarked, untouched. Clinical finishing. Yates, go! 3-1, Orlando. And this crowd has gone silent. Choice, Summer Yates steps up, goes for power, goes back across, Kingsbury going the wrong way. And this is just feeding the confidence of a young player who has been such a difference maker for this Pride team early on. Terry tried to get it through, taken away by Hatch. Fires, oh, off for house and in! The goalkeeper gap brings Washington back into the game. Touch inside by Bia. Sidestep shot. Di Bernardo! What a remarkable goal to level it for the current. It's just about individual brilliance because I was just about to make the point that Angel City has done so well. The commitment defensively. Look at the players around the ball. But then it's just a quick little touch to be able to re release Di Bernardo. And she takes that so well. Gets all the way through it. Megan Reed trying to defend Bia, then trying to defend Di Bernardo. And look at the strike, just commits through it. Dabinia. Dabinia slides this along. Ball whipped across! Kansas City have their goal! Lavo J is flying! Perhaps back to Kansas City with all three points. Any laps defensively against this Kansas City team, they're going to make you pay. Wide open on that far side, Rodriguez. Dabinia feeds her. She had drawn a couple of defenders. Again, almost like identical that we saw for Angel City. That space opens up. You have time to be able to pick out. And Lavage in a great position to stay out of it initially. And then just commits to the near post. It hasn't been the best game for Shawinga compared to what we've seen for the first five games. Shawinga shrugs off. Shawinga, ball bounces in front. Lavoje pumps it home. There's the dagger for Kansas City. And after Miss 
missing all of last season. Lavage will be so happy to be in this position. They've got the numbers back, but it's just too easy. In between the two defenders for Lavage, she just sneaks in. Well done from Harachi to be able to get a hand on it, but not enough. It keeps it alive. All out wide, Sanchez with tons of space. Sanchez plays it across and it's flicked in. Something here is it's brought down by Smith. Shot taken. There's the first goal. Portland leads on a Smith tally. So she gets this one squared up against Malazzo. Freezes the defender. Stop, start, little twist. Look at the window she gets off right there. Such a small window, and she's able to fire it through. A small window here with perfect. Perfect precision in the corner. And Sophia Smith's causing a handful of problems. Defend it well into a narrow angle. Sinclair leads it. There's Smith again, and she's got two. Sophia Smith. And the Portland Thorns lead by two. Ball unleashes Sinclair running at the back line, draws attention to herself. And Sophia Smith, well timed run. Sink delivers a delicious ball in here. Alyssa Nair trying to put pressure. And again, it's Sophia Smith's finishing ability inside the penalty area. Her composure, her awareness, her vision to see the oncoming goalkeeper and where the spaces are. Sophia Smith with the brace. A beat to get used to it, but she's she likes the creativity, creativity and freedom that she has. Dunny. Two defenders swarm off her right foot. What a strike, Mackenzie Dunny. Shaw, McCaskill, Bennett, cross in, wow, San Diego! Kunanji leaves it for King, puts on a cross. Sharples was the option. Cassianos looks up, Sharples header! Off the cross for our second chance, Oshawala! Another Sharples reruns here, finds a header which bangs off the crossbar, but then not only Oshawala is there, Bodhi is there, and one of them was going to find a way to put this in the back of the net. And it's Asisat Ashwala, her second goal now for this Bay squad. And it's an important one. It gets them back in this game. They level yet again on a set piece. That's going to be an easy goal every single time. Ryan. See ya. There's that pace you said for Emma Sears. Why not? Just waiting for her team to catch up with her. <laughs> Here she is, the rookie. To her left foot, puts it across, bounces oh. around, off of Turner and in! The rookies creating for Racing Louisville! And here's the first defender she beats. See you later to the second defender. Then she brings Emily Sana all the way over and look at Sears. She baits her in to say, I'm gonna go to my right. Nope, chop, see ya. 
There goes that defender, and then a good cross back because it's in this area where it's difficult for the defenders to defend there because they're running at their back line, and sometimes good things happen. Sheehan's all the way on the end line, so there's two defenders behind the ball. Raylan Turner is on side, and my goodness, that is a delightful finish. Lavelle has something to say about that. Ryan. Bruninha curls it up. Limes, Bob.